I'm Mark Leia. I'm Steve Stanford, and welcome to Art You Can Drive. <laughs> Today we're going to take a look at a 1963 Corvette convertible. You know, Steve, never really been a Corvette guy. Oh you know. man, I can slap you for that. Okay, oh, why? Oh, I know. Well, you know what? It's just, it, I never really spent any time with them, but I spent some time with this car. Mm -hmm. You know, when you really take a look at this car, split bumpers, hideaway headlights, you know, the dual tail lights, dual exhaust, the waterfall dash, and then we actually did some work on it. We made it more drivable, put power steering, power brakes in the car. And, you know, I drove this car around and really at the end of the day, that's what it's all about, driving this car around. Well, now that, but I mean, it being a Corvette, it's also all about the romance of being seen in it, everybody waving, yeah. giving, giving you the thumbs up. And Corvettes have that kind of romance and, 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 and design integrity and just the whole deal, right? See, the thing is, you got to remember with this particular Corvette, this, they started with a clean sheet of paper for this design. This is what they referred to as the Generation 2 Corvette because the, the, the ones from 53 to 62 was a completely different design. Now, with this, we start getting into what they call uh, the Bill Mitchell era. He was the major design guy at General Motors. That's why this car looks the way it does. He was looking to establish himself and a whole new design ethos, and that's what makes the romance of these cars so possible. Well, and that's the thing, you know, and, and really when you look at it, you look at the sculpture of the fenders mm -hmm. and, you know, and how they made the body lines on. It's a really swoopy car, but, you know, it's, again, it looks really good, but to me, the appeal is you drive this car down PCH oh. with the top down, you know, everybody loves it. You oh, know, absolutely. You get a thumbs I'm up saying, from everybody. Listen, pop stars you know. have written songs about Corvettes from day, from day one. I mean, who hasn't, who doesn't remember the lyrics of Little Red Corvette, for instance, right? It's yeah. that kind of romance and, you know, and, and, and the, you know, the whole appeal of just, that's what makes these cars what they are. I mean, we're talking about the chiseled lines. We're talking about the fame the singer scoop. hood, the hideaway lights. You don't find it on your, just your regular commuter type car. This is a car for special occasions that can be used every day. Well, and I think, you know, what Bill Mitchell succeeded with with this car is building in a lot of emotion. Oh, absolutely. There's a lot of emotion in this car. You bet. And it translates into the driving experience, which, you know, again, I was never really into it, but I drove this car and I really like this car. Now and it's a fun appeal. car to drive. Yeah, you so see the appeal. So we're going to take a look under the hood. Yeah, sure. And, you know, again, when you look at these cars, so, you know, you look at this thing, you know, 1963, they put Corvette on the valve cover in case you were confused. Yeah, right. But it's a bold statement. This is a Corvette. This isn't any other Chevy car. Chrome air cleaner, a lot of nice little details in it. So, you know, really easy to work on by the same standpoint. You know. Yeah, but look at it from, 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 I'm looking at it from the artsy standpoint. Sure. I mean, come on, this, this is an engine that, that has romance written all over it. We know it's, it can, it's a performer, but it also, it just looks so good just looking at yeah. it. It makes you, makes you, it makes working on it a pleasure if sure. you have to, the changing the plugs, and it just, it, it reminds you of what it is just from the Corvette on the valve covers, right? Yeah. That to me is romance. That, that, that's what I really love about this type of car. And you know the best part? There's no plastic in here. That's right. You know? that's so right. that's cool. This is definitely art you can drive. Then you know what time it is. 